There's no such thing as too much carbon fiber. So we're gonna take an already nice engine bait and make it even better with an armor speed carbon intake. So as mentioned, we're changing this current Ram Air filter for a Armour Speed carbon fibre intake kit. And it must be said, there's nothing all that wrong with the Ram Air intake. It's actually a very good price point and delivers in terms of sound and performance, but it can be improved on. And one of the ways is a nice carbon air box that is effectively keeping the heat down by it being more of an enclosed design, as well as updating some of the pipework, the carbon fiber, as well as the ducting. So let me show on the bench a little bit about these parts so you can really understand them a little bit more whilst they're off the car. So much of the way that the filter that's currently on there, we've got a, a nano woven, I believe the term is, uh, cotton filter, which is effectively going to be a serviceable part. So in 10, 20, 50,000 miles, we can still use this. Then got a carbon, elbow slash joiner that takes the intake pipe then to the filter so it'll end up looking like that and the obvious part is this carbon intake or air box which is obviously very very well expensive looking and that is because it is expensive however it is a better more cost effective option than some of the other carbon intakes on the market so i think this actually has a very good price point so as said this is a full carbon part this is an enclosed, so if I flip it on its back, you'll see the air box six in here. This is obviously going to the front where the air will channel in um, and that will then reach our nano woven filter at the front. So that's effectively what it'll look like on the car. And I'm excited to get this one on. As I said, there are some other carbon options. Eventuri is one of them, but it's double the price of this particular intake. So is it double as good? I can tell you now it's not going to be, but proof's going to be in the pudding on this one. So we're going to get this installed. You guys are going to hear what it's going to sound like. We'll do a few little revs and, and a little run outside so you can get a, an idea. But I'm excited to get this one on just as a little teaser as well, because we work quite closely with Armour Speed. They actually have produced as a one off for us a forged carbon intake top cover because we also offer a forged carbon fiber engine cover as well as a twill engine cover so you're going to see the difference and although we don't have it with us now it's actually en route so we'll film this part now watch a little bit later on and you'll see the forged cover as well enjoy this one it's going to be fun so as you can see the engine bay of our f56 is already upgraded so you've got the program filter set there as well as one of our more unique modifications or upgrades which is the dipstick there check out the other video on that one and also our own unique carbon fiber skinned cold air intake to match so unfortunately that's all got to go to make way for the armor speed so i'm going to remove this intake uh, remove all of it back to the forge silicon hose there so this will look slightly different to a stock engine mode obviously but same theory applies remove your air box and air filter system and then you're ready to install the armor speed um, only thing for us is I'm going to have to see what happens when it comes to making it work with our dipstick. So a little bit of work to do there potentially, but the rest of it should be straightforward. I'm going to crack on. See you guys at the end. So the carbon armor speed intake is installed and doesn't it look absolutely savage? It's better than I was expecting. I saw it on the top, but until you see it plugged into this engine bay, it doesn't give you the real depth of what it's all about. So that's in, looks fantastic. We're gonna do a little bit of a video in a week or two's time when the forged cover gets shipped in from them. Um, and we're gonna show you forged engine cover, forged top cover if you like for the intake and then we're going to do some sound videos so stay tuned for the next part we're probably going to have a different haircut by then and you're going to hear this thing on the road and revving up i've had a little bit of a sneak 
preview already and it sounds amazing. A couple weeks later and with a fresh haircut, I'm back to talk to you about the forged carbon fibre armour speed intake that we've got here and also our own forged engine cover. So these are made to effectively complement each other. So armour speed didn't actually make a forged carbon version until I said to them, guys, we now do not only a forged engine cover, but forged diffuser and forged ducts here as well. That you can see in here i don't suppose you could make one of forged carbon fibers they said well it's a bit more difficult to make but yeah we can hook you up and that's what they've done here today so as you saw in the other video we had a twill version that goes really well with the twill engine cover and maybe some of the other twill carbon fiber that we produced for this car this one's obviously got the forged carbon fiber and it looks fantastic it's well, one thing that i like about it's a bit nerdy but one thing that i really like about forged carbon fiber is no parts no two parts will ever ever be the same every strand is always slightly different. Whereas with twill, you can lay up in a very similar fashion to the point where you can have two parts that look very similar. You can't do that with forged carbon fibre. They all look different. So isn't that amazing? One final thought, if you like, to leave you guys with. You might be wondering, okay, so why is it more expensive than say the Ram Air Pro, Pro Ram kit or something similar? Because there's quite a few intake similar to this and just look at the difference you've got a carbon intake you've got a carbon bottom cover for the intake itself top cover and then obviously you've got the filter element itself it's a completely different design there's a lot more to it it's not just a simple metal shroud a cone filter there's so much carbon fiber to this it looks amazing thank you guys very much for watching really appreciate it a little like subscribe and even a comment would be appreciated but what do you fancy do you like the forged carbon or the twill if you've made it this far leave a comment let me know i'll be interested to know but thanks again see you guys soon